In my AMD Radeon graphics driver there are a couple of scaling options and you might be familiar with center full panel and preserve aspect ratio but what is integer scaling? So what does it look like? Here we have Cirrus Sam the second encounter running at 640x480 on a 1440p monitor with center scaling. So we have a small image in the center of the screen with black space all around. This is what full panel looks like. The image gets stretched to fit the entire screen. And here we have the option called preserve aspect ratio. The game runs at the 4x3 aspect ratio and it's now scaled to fit the entire height of the monitor with black bars on the side. And here we have integer scaling and uh, yeah let's toggle back and forth between preserve aspect ratio and integer scaling and in the photo it's actually really hard to see so let's zoom in a little bit closer and now the differences become a lot more obvious. So we're switching back and forth between the preserve aspect ratio and the integer scaling and you can see that with the integer scaling we're seeing nice clear sharp pixels, chunky pixels. Uh, yeah we get that pixelated retro look. And another good example is the first Fallout game. This one is hard coded at 640x480. Um, we're zooming in right at the beginning of the game and once again with the integer scaling you can see that the pixels are nice and sharp with clear boundaries whereas the preserve aspect ratio is a lot more blurry and fuzzy. So we now know what integer scaling looks like. Let's dig a little bit deeper. Why is this happening? We have an image here, three by three pixels with uh, red pixels in the corners and in the center and the other pixels are yellow. So let's go image resize and we are doubling the resolution, six by six and we're using bilinear which is the scaling technology that the AMD and NVIDIA drivers use and we can see what it's doing here. We can see on the, on the outside we still have the red pixels but here it's trying to blend the colors. Um, we get a color between yellow and red, some sort of an orange but it definitely does a lot, not look anything like the original. However, if we go to resize and we double the resolution but use the nearest neighbor scaling, then we get exactly what we want. We get razor sharp uh, pixels. And what integer scaling is, it's basically uh, multiplying the uh, resolution with integer multiples. So times two, times three, times four, times five, and you get um, pixels that are nice and sharp, nice and clear, whereas with the built-in scaling that the drivers are offering, we're getting a blurry and soft image. So we had a look at what integer scaling looks like and also how it works. Now it gets a little bit uh, boring with the numbers. Across here we've got some popular resolution of games and here we have some popular monitors and it's all to do with the math and unfortunately integer scaling is not very flexible. The bottom line is uh, to take advantage of integer scaling with retro games that run at higher resolutions like these resolutions you actually want to have a 4k monitor. For example let's say you've got a 1080p monitor the only resolution that really works for you is 640x480 you can scale it by 2 to 1280 by 960 and you will have a nice image and without integer scaling 1280 by 960 and 1280 by 1024 so really you, you only have three resolutions that look really nice if you've got a 1440p monitor then 640 by 480 will look perfect it fits integer uh, perfectly into 1440p 800 by 600 scales to 600, 1600 by 1200 which fits nice into 1440p but you have some black bars at the top. These res uh, resolutions the monitor does not have enough pixels. So um, yeah, unfortunately it's not as flexible because we're using integer multiplications um, but it is what it is. So 
Yeah, guys, I hope this makes sense and uh, not too confusing. If you have specific questions, please leave them down below. Uh, Intel, NVIDIA and AMD support integer scaling with NVIDIA like yeah, like they like to do uh, is lock out older video cards. Uh, they claim it only works on, on certain cores and I think this is just uh, nonsense. Integer scaling is really trivial to implement in my opinion. Um, so yeah, but with AMD cards it should work on a heap uh, range of video cards, also in Intel and uh, if you're running games at lower resolutions and you're missing that pixel look check it out. If you've got the right combination of game resolution and monitor, then it should work well for you. If you've got specific questions, please leave them down below. I hope this video made sense. It is very specific uh, and only useful for very specific situations. But if you, for example, play uh, Fallout on a 1440p monitor with integer scaling, it will look absolutely beautiful and much better than with the built-in scaling and that's it thank you for watching give it a thumbs up if you found this interesting and you want to see more videos like this one and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already share the video with your friends and i see you soon with another one